Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing a get ready with me. I have a virtual sorority informational, which is like an information session tonight online. So I'm gonna get ready for that just cause like, why not? You know, I'd get ready for it if it was like happening in real life. So I'm going to do my makeup. All right, everyone. So before I got on camera again, I decided to apply the moisturizer that I used before I do my makeup, which is the Skin Rescue Daily Face Cream. So now we're gonna go in with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance that my mom just gave me. And so I'm gonna prime my eyeshadow. In my last video, I said that I always do my foundation before my eyeshadow, but then I tried doing my eyeshadow before my foundation and I let, actually liked it. So now I see why people do that. I'm gonna apply the primer. All right, so I have primed my eyes, and now I'm gonna show you the palette we're using today, which is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina palette. I've had this for a while, never made a video with it. Then again, I haven't done a lot of makeup videos, but I really like this palette. I kind of wish it had more purple, but the Pro Norvina palette actually does have purple, and that I also have, but I didn't want to go too, like, because the colors there are, like, pretty, pretty intense. So I kind of want to go a little softer today, which is why I'm using the regular palette. All right, so first we're going to dip into the color base, right over here. And we're just going to cover both of my lids because, you know, we want that base. Alrighty, so today I think I'm gonna do kind of like a shimmery look, but just to give the eyes some dimension, I'm going to dip into Incense, which is right over here, and kind of like put it on the outsides, and then we're gonna go into the shimmery shades. So I'm gonna go and do that. Alright everyone, so I'm gonna try to do this as fast as I can because my battery's running low. I don't know why I forgot to charge it if I knew I was gonna film a video, but it is what it is. So, alright everyone, so now we're going to put Love over here, followed by Wild Child like in the inner eye, and then we're gonna put Rose Gold over here on the outer eye. We're just gonna do that real quick. All right, so I put everything on my eye. Now I'm kind of, kind of like, I'm gonna like try and like blend everything to make sure everything's like nice and blended. So nothing looks crazy. Kind of trying to go fast. My camera's making me nervous. It says it's about to die. Yeah. All right, so for the eyes, that's kind of it. We're gonna put on mascara. I'm gonna do that off camera. And then we're gonna go into the face. Exciting. All right, everyone, I'm back. For my mascara, I didn't mention that I would be using Benefit's Roller Lash. So yeah, I really I really like this mascara, it make them, makes them look all voluminous. Now we're kind of going, we're gonna, gonna be going into the face. We're gonna be priming the face. Kind of like in the nose, this area is where I use e.l.f.'s Poreless Putty Primer. Honestly, I really like it. It really like, once you put on foundation, like it looks like you don't have pores. You kind of just have to like, like nail it out. And then you just apply it. I apply it with my fingers cause I don't really mind. So that's not the only thing I use on my face. Apart from the putty primer, I also use the No Pore Blum Primer by Touch Insole. This I also really like. I just do like one pump, one and a half, and I just put that on the rest of my face. All right, so since I kind of have some blemishes like over here and I don't want that to show through the foundation, I'm going to put some green on there, which will cancel out the red. And then I'm going to apply my foundation. Like I don't like put too much. You ain't got to get crazy. Just, you know, just so it doesn't show through the foundation. Oh, that was a lot. Ah, I didn't need that. So for today's foundation, we're going to be doing Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place uh, Makeup Foundation. And... Honestly, I really like this foundation. I feel like I kind of slipped on it for a while. Like this was like the foundation that my mom bought for me. And I like, I don't know. Also, it might've been that I was trying to use it in the summer and winter just ended. So I'm kind of pasty and this works fine. I apply it straight to the beauty blender and then to the face. I don't know if that's the correct way to do it, but that's how I do it. So yeah, it's interesting because it kind of when I first put it on the face It almost looks like it's too tan for me, but it's actually fine 
All right, so I applied foundation. I don't know if I look crazy or not, but um, also I forgot to mention that the sponge I was using is the Real Technique sponge. Really good. Now it's time to conceal my face. My mom gave me a new concealer today, which is the Revolution or the Makeup Revolution London Conceal and Define. So we're gonna see, I don't know if this is my shade or not, but cause it was hers and she's like a little bit more tanner than me. But we're gonna see, we're gonna see. This will be fine. Okay, so that is after I concealed. Honestly, it ended up being a perfect color, which is great. Now we're just gonna, you know, put some powder on that. I have the original Formula Airspun Loose Face Powder. I feel like a lot of y'all have this. So I'm just gonna apply some of that with the sponge. I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do, but it's what I do. Comment below if I'm doing something wrong or if you have a better suggestion for what I'm doing, cause I don't know. So we're gonna wait for that to, you know, bake or whatever it is that y'all call it. All right, y'all, so now I'm going to dust off that powder with this brush that I have. We're just gonna do that. So now we're gonna do contour or uh, bronzer or whatever. I have the Hoola Benefit. Honestly, I'm still trying to figure out how to like kind of bronze my face because honestly, I don't, know, I don't really know. I just recently kind of learned how to like, ooh, I feel like that was not what I was supposed to do. Oh no, that looks so bad. Okay, w listen, we're gonna fix that. Something about like the top of your ears and like the corner of your mouth, like you're supposed to like kind of do that. I'm also doing the rest of my face, you know, gotta minimize the forehead. Okay, I'm looking like like low-key crazy so basically this brush is gonna fix everything because it's gonna erase the mistakes and blend everything out so I don't look crazy we're almost done which is great because my camera's about to die I can't forget uh, the highlighter that's important I don't have a highlighter brush to be honest but this is gonna have to do I wish this had a mirror so I'm just gonna look at the viewfinder and it's just gonna have to be fine I'm gonna use forever young in the Nicole Guerrero Anastasia Beverly Hills glow kit I love this glow kit I've had this like forever. Oh, oh, so that's also a little much, but we have the face brush eraser to fix everything. It's all good. I also like to put some tip on my nose over right here. Second to last but not least, we're gonna do, I have this like artistry, um, lip thingy. I'm not trying to go crazy with the lips because I don't know. I just don't see the need. So we're gonna apply this. It's just like, it's basically just gloss, but it's kind of pink tinted. Oh, that looks good. That I like that. Oh, and also I always, always, always love to add um, eyeshadow under my eyes. I feel like it just gives it like a little complete look. So I'm gonna use like this brush that's like matte thin and we're gonna go, I'm gonna go under my eyes with the shade Love. I'm just gonna get under there. You know what I mean? And we're also gonna put a little bit of rose gold, like kind of like on the outside. Basically, we're just trying to mirror the top to the bottom. And then also make sure I'm gonna put more Glow Child like in here. Our inner corner. And you know what? We're gonna take the Glow Kit again and we're gonna go in the corner with Kitty Cat, which is pink, so like it makes sense. We get that extra, extra glow. Perfect. Ooh, I like it. And now the very last step, I'm so glad my camera didn't die, is to um, set my face with Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set. My mom gave this to me also, and I like it. And that's makeup, getting ready with me so that I look nice for my sorority's informational tonight. Thank you for coming to my channel. Give this video a like if you enjoyed what I did. Subscribe if you want to see more content. I don't only make makeup videos. I make a lot of other content as well. I will see you in the next one. Again, thank you so, so much. Have a great night.